Hello everybody and welcome back to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast video on the channel. Today we will actually be taking a close look at Todd the Pizza Planet truck. Now of course he is a very unique character, uh, doesn't have any speaking lines in all the three movies and yes he did appear in all three movies. He is a little Pixar easter egg which of course was first seen in Toy Story 2 back in 1999 and ever since then he has been in every single Pixar movie that has been released so yeah make sure you watch all the Pixar movies to see where he was seen he was seen in Brave he was seen in Finding Nemo Finding Dory all of those and the most iconic one is actually Cars and Toy Story because they in Cars they actually made him as a die cast so yeah Let's take a close look at his Racerama packaging in 2009. So yeah, we can see the Racerama logo there, which looks absolutely pretty cool and amazing with the little bolt there. We can see the World of Cars logo there too. It looks absolutely cool with the Disney Pixar World of Cars. Looks amazing. We can see Todd the Pizza Planet truck's artwork with just Larry Camper in the background there. But yep, yeah, he looks absolutely cool. We can see Todd the Pizza Planet truck facing to the left. Todd, of course, T O W D, because he was 93 in the line, and we can see the 95 force there too. Little poster that you do get in, of course, all the packaging. On the back, not too much about Todd, just meet my friend Andrea. How are you friends with that? Like, Lightning, how did you become friends with Andrea? Not going to talk about that, but yet, yeah, of course, he, this one is made in China. So yeah, I am actually going to take a close look at that variant of Todd the Pizza Planet truck now, which is this one. Here is the base, made in 2009, of course the 149th day, so yeah, nine, 2009. So yeah, can't believe this one is 11 years old already. But yeah, he's got this nice smiling expression with two red lights at the front with this bumper. He's got this nice grill there with the headlights and of course the rust. Pretty cool, he's got rust all over him. Of course, two rusty bits there. I thought it was a bit of dirt, but you know, it is actually part of the die cast. He's got his mirrors on both sides. He's got nice blue eyes with yellow eyelids. Looks pretty cool. On the side, we've got a Pizza Planet, because he is a Pizza Planet truck. Pizza Planet. There's the rocket from Toy Story, which looks pretty cool. On the back, not too much to talk about, just a window and some details. Nice rims. We've got his indicator there. And of course, Pizza Planet. We could read that there if you want to. Looks pretty cool. We can see dirt decals all around. Looks amazing with these nice black rims. On the back, his license is well, he doesn't actually have a license plate. I'll talk about that in a few minutes here. But yeah, the back reads Yo. He's got his two rear lights there. Of course, the window with the white back there too. Rear bumper looks pretty cool. And I have already shown you the base. Now he wasn't released again for another five years in, of course, the 2014 packaging. As you can see, part of the RSN series, now facing the other way. Did come with a name tag, though, this time. So, you know, if you have that name tag, a little bit collectible, to be honest with you. He was number eight out of eight in the line. And we can see, of course, a few other cars as well. There is the prototype image that they used to smack on the back of the packaging. And, of course, it says Dr. Peter Planet Truck. 2013 copyright to represent that it was released in 2014. Now this is the variant here, of course I do have this one. The only main difference is of course these two little splats here as you can see, look they're no longer there. If you can see, looks pretty cool. Not too much to talk about. Maybe the Pizza Planet logo thing is more dustier. As you can see, look on the top there is more brown on the side compared to the 2010 release or nine I should say sorry so that's how you can tell the two apart so it, this is technically a variant no license plate and here is the base of this one for some reason they flipped the code the other way around 88th date in 2014 now in between that of course there was a Disney store release before you know the Cars 3 one which looks pretty cool very much massive of course you can read the other decals there delivery shuttle yo Disney store base if you are interested for those collectors it's pretty cool actually in my opinion 
And then in 2017, he was released again in Cars 3, the most boring packaging ever. But I believe he was like a Kroger exclusive. I'm not 100% sure on that. But yeah, in the US, he was a Kroger exclusive. And now, the Cars 3 variant of Todd, Todd the Pizza Planet truck is actually very, very, very hard to find, in my opinion, and pretty expensive. But he is a demolition derby racer. For some reason, he is clean. There's been a massive topic about this in the world of cars. Why is he clean? Like, you'd at least expect the Cars 1 variant of Todd to be clean, not the Cars 3 version. But yeah, anyways, there is his packaging. Here's the variant, of course, you can see it's all clean. No dirt on the decals, no dirt at all, which is what I do like. Of course, a clean Todd. There's the top. You can see the yellow on the back. It's got a few dents there though, and here is the base, this way around, made in the third day in 2017, literally the third day, that's funny, but yeah, that's pretty cool, and of course, one last thing is the Mini Racer, now of course, talking about the license plate, of course he looks pretty cool in this Mini variant, he does actually have one here, RES15, 36 so you can finally see a license plate and it does have a few other things on the back too like a nice little emoji there and some speed limit signs looks pretty cool one last super thing which is not actually made by cars it is actually made by Hot Wheels the Pizza Planet truck with no eyes it looks absolutely cool I really do want this one out of the package there is also a Brave variant of course with the wooden version of the Pizza Planet truck you guys know what I mean, you Hot Wheels collectors know what I mean there is a wooden version of this one that is released but yeah, that does end my complete history or video on Todd the Pizza Planet truck I've been meaning to do this video for quite a while so you know, thank you to everybody who did watch this far I'm going to bring back all the variants of Todd here now for you guys so you can take another look at them again but yeah if you are new to the channel, please make sure you leave a like, comment and subscribe. When you do subscribe, hit that bell notification down below. And of course, to the very, very next video guys. Peace.